In the past, the art that we would see in museums and galleries was quite similar to the work that we would show in our own homes, paintings, photographs, and prints. But these days, the art world is taking a more varied approach, showing everything from performance to pyrotechnics. So I install art. Going straight into Oakville, my first ins installation there was uh, fig trees, uh, John Grayson's uh, fig trees. And that was a huge, it was, it was more of a, um, an opera. There was um, little monitors on, with a little model train going around. Everything, everything was in it. If I'm at the AGO, yeah, there's like regular things that we do. We tear down walls, then we rebuild walls, we paint, and then we bring in art and we hang it. Depending on the venue and the job, Angelo is an art technician, a technical director, a production designer, and an AV guy. It's hard to pin him down to one job title. Let's say art installer. No, no, make art work. The guy who makes the art work. Perfect. <laughs> this is Giuseppe Pannone, and, and it was installed in the Galleria Italia, yeah. and it was a number of very large wooden sculptures, trees that were carved into trees. I mean, just a phenomenal exhibition and Pannone is a very well-known Italian artist. And was he there when you did the installation? Yeah. And how did that go? Excellent. He spoke Italian, I spoke Italian, <laughs> so we got along. In order to get the work in, yeah. they were so big and so long that we actually took the window out and had to, okay, with, a crane, and, yeah. with a crane, go through the window. It was, a be it was beautiful when they were there. There's Pannone so, sort of taking an exacto knife to his uh, sculpture work, there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. So, seven <laughs> A eleven D was here uh, two years ago. So we're using this studio, the next studio, the following studio, and that studio. What was your role in terms of um, the installation or working with the artists? Getting whatever equipment the artists needed mm -hmm. or just simply bolting something onto a wall so that when they stretched it with all their weight, mm -hmm. it wouldn't come yeah. off the wall. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah. that, and that was great. Performance artists are the best. I mean, they're, they're just, they put themselves on the line. What you might not know about Angelo is that he moved into art installing from a background in acting and performance. It was detrimental to the family. I had to think of the future. The future of all the katanas. He's got the leather jacket. Oh, yeah, he's, got so... the, he's got the strut. <laughs> We're going back a few years. This is, this is actually the 70s and the 80s and the, a little bit into the 90s where I, that's, I, that's all I was doing was acting. Mm -hmm. And I was uh, basically, I had a career. Yeah. And uh, in order to make money, you had to do like really cheesy <laughs> things. Uh, so I actually had to say these lines. Got her in the upper right quadrant of the 38. It looks like big league damage. My partner, Johanna Householder, I don't yes. know if you know her. She's yes. a performance, performance artist. artist. Yeah. yeah, she's done a lot, a lot of work, media work. These are performances that are conceived with the two of you in mind. Okay. Well, no, it's the two of us. It's the two of you <laughs> con conceiving the performance. Okay. Figuring it out. Okay, okay. Oh, wow. There's ice coming down. So what was that before? Was that earth? or it, That was earth and it was just packed with firecrackers and it just blew up. So Angelo, how has the way that artists approach the gallery space changed what you do? Well, they kind of want to break out of the white cube and also use the whole gallery as an installation. So for example, this was not what it looked like mm -hmm. in, uh, when I was installed for Isabella Rocamora. In fact, it was completely different. So we're building walls. Uh, artists are using other mediums besides just paint. So it's not just a painting on a wall. It's a lot more complex. It's an exciting time to be an artist and an art lover with all these expanding options and opportunities. And if Angelo's enthusiasm is any measure, it's also an exciting time to be an art installer. <laughs>